It's day one of the state wrestling individual tournament. We have crews in Champaign and Des Moines covering each and every round. KWQC's Andrew Ward is in Des Moines. He begins our coverage, highlighting a busy day at Wells Fargo Arena. Hundreds packed into Wells Fargo Arena Thursday for day one of the state wrestling tournament. Class 3A kicked things off bright and early. A huge day for North Scott. The Lancers sent eight wrestlers to the quarterfinals, including Jacob Skipper at 113 pounds with a tech fall. Heavyweight Cole Ernst with a takedown and double overtime to move on. And defending 220 pounds state champ Wyatt Reitz with a massive pin over the number four wrestler in the state. He's supposed to be our number four kid in the state, so to get a pin in the first period, it feels good. And three more matches. A big round for Bettendorf as well. Four Bulldogs advance. Alex Lopez. Wins a tight match at 170 pounds, and Will Jefferson with a 3 0 decision at 132 pounds. We've been working for this all year, and it's good to be moving on. This is my first year winning the match at state, so. Clinton heavyweight Tyler Clark is one of two River Kings advancing with an 8 to 2 win. Other MAC wrestlers to advance Burlington Spencer Sherwood at 182 pounds and Ryan Lloyd of Pleasant Valley at 160 pounds, each pinned to win. And Central's lone representative at the tournament, Sam Serrano, moves on as well with a narrow 3 2 win at 195 pounds. I mean, it feels great to be the only one I present, but at the same time, I kind of miss my teammate support. Class 1A took center stage this afternoon. Three Wilton Beavers head to the quarterfinals. Corey Anderson at 126 pounds. Trey Brisker with a top five win at 145 pounds. And Bryce Ovison with a 6-3 win at 182 pounds. It feels good that we all came out here as a team, and it feels good that when one of us starts to win, we all get pumped up. Mediapolis advances two wrestlers, 152-pounder Brennan Swafford with a second period fall. Zach Osborne moves on at 126 pounds. Also, Louisa Muscatine's top-ranked 138-pounder Austin Leopard advances with a first period pin. Day one is now in the books for classes 1A and 3A. We will have much more from class 2A coming up tonight at 10. Reporting from Wells Fargo Arena in Des Moines, Andrew Ward, KWQC TV6 Sports.